Many thanks for joining us on Innovate TV. I'm joined today by Yari from Speaksy and Barry from Carillion. Welcome both. Nice to meet you. And we're here to talk about Soundshape from Speaksy. It's a fantastic technology that allows visitors at events to receive live subtitles and translation in more than 100 languages, direct to the smartphone, tablet, laptop, or via a large screen in a venue, for example. So Yari, um, first question to you, how did this product come about? Our mission is inspired by the fact that both of my parents are deaf. So growing up, I saw how extremely difficult it was for my parents to follow what's being said during live events, theater plays, conferences. Virtually, they didn't even go to those uh, situations because they knew it wouldn't be accessible. And that's why we developed the Soundshape One Pro to make any event accessible as a standard. So what would you say, Yari, with the, the USBs of, of Soundshape? USP, sorry. So the Soundshape One Pro is, a, is the first speech-to-text and translation system designed specifically for the AV uh, integrators and system integrator industry. Um, it's very accurate. That's what a lot of customers like um, PwC, Goodwood, and also the London Marathon are telling us that they are particularly pleased by how accurate the live captions and also the translations actually are compared to other AI solutions. And like I said, it's the first um, device specifically designed for the AV industry, which makes it plug and play. It's really easy to integrate into the standard workflows and signal flows of um, AV system integrators. It's plug and play, you only need three cables, an audio cable and a power cable and an internet cable, and it just works immediately. It can be displayed, the captions and the translations on different screens. So either the visitor can scan a QR code, select their own language of preference and read what's being said on their own mobile device, or the event organizer can integrate the live captions on the presentation screen, overlaying over the presentation content which is really unique. Um, that, so it's um, Soundshape One Pro is a very accurate solution, very easy to integrate and very easy to customize through our admin panel environment. So an event organizer system integrator can log into a web app and really customize the entire subtitling experience and manage everything, uh, which makes it very easy to, to use this and make accessibility for the deaf, hard of hearing and people who don't speak the language truly uh, effortless. Barry, I wanted to, to come to you next. You're obviously working for a system integrator called Carillion. What, what are the opportunities that something like Soundshake will, will bring to the AV world from, from your perspective? Yeah, it's quite interesting for us, Paul, because we, um, if I go to another product, Surface Hub, uh, we saw that at ISC um, a long time ago, and it was innovative. We brought it into the business. Again, last year at ISC, some of the team saw Soundshake, um, we looked at it, we then come back because part of what we do every time we go to IAC is we look for innovation and new products that we can work with um, and it just stood out. So we've spent a little bit of time getting to know it and obviously with Yari and the team. For us, it's quite interesting in the corporate space because if you look at the UK population as a whole, you've got 18 million people who are either deaf or have a hearing um, impairment. So it's like one in four of the population. So they are excluded. It's, it's almost like an invisible disability for a lot of people. So it's underrepresented. So if you look in the corporate space, um, we're looking at addressing, obviously, anyone who has large meeting rooms, venues. Um, and for us, that's, that's something where we can work. It's something that we're familiar with. Um, as Yari said, um, it works easy with like Crestron and AMX and Extron. You know, we can interface it very easily. It fits in a rack. So it's, again, it's not outside our comfort zone. Um, and, you know, we know where we can go with it. There's, if we look outside of corporate, you've got people like the NHS spending £175,000 a day on translation services. Wow. So there is a market to address there. You know, DWP, $8 million, Home Office, undisclosed. I think the last figures they released were in 2022, and there it was about $9 million. So they are doing conferences. They are doing large meetings. They're required by law in the U.K., to be able to provide these services. So we're thinking that they're people that we can talk to. It's, and it's, we're not even looking at it like a market. We're all, everybody is already embedded with it here um, because we just see it as being a solution that's needed. Um, one of the things that um, Yari was talking to us about a few weeks ago was um, the customization. 
So if you're, say, um, like the Royal College of Radiologists or the Gynecologists or any of those type of people, they have a dictionary that is outside of our understanding and words that we can't even pronounce, n never going to be able to spell, great scrapple scores. But we can add those into the system so when they're using it at a conference, um, say, everyone understands it and it comes out with the exact word and not just the whole stream of letters. So for us, it's, it works with the way that we do and probably the rest of the industry. And there's a, there's a huge need for it in conferences, in venues. Um, you know, I think Yeri touched on like the London Marathon and Goodwood. And um, down at Goodwood there, they used it for the screens um, all around the circuit. So there was live transcription in any of the languages because obviously you can select any one of the hundred languages on the app. Um, and it just makes it accessible. Um, you know, it's not just for the hard of hearing. There you've got people who are, you know, not native English speakers, people who are neurodiverse and like to absorb stuff through words. So that's where we're trying to work with it, I think, and it's a great mm -hmm. partnership. I think you, you made a really interesting point. It, this isn't just for a tiny portion of the society, right? This is going to no. affect a lot of people, even the yeah. hard of hearing, but also the, the different languages as well. Like it opens it up yeah. to a whole new world. Yari, for those people who are interested to find out more on Speaksy and, and Soundshape, what's the best way to do that, for them to do that? So if you're based in the UK, the best way to get in touch and understand more about uh, the Soundshape One Pro solution is to get in touch with Carillion who are our um, designated partner for the UK specifically and re request a demo um, and um, go from there. That's the, the best way to learn more if you're based in the UK. Um, we also have our own dedicated website. If you want to learn more about the product specifically, you can go to uh, soundshape.pro. And Barry, you probably can mention the Carillion uh, website link so that people can, can find you guys directly. Yeah, we're nice and easy. It's carillion.com. Fantastic. Um, gents, many thanks for your time. It's, as a journalist, I'm forever being sent things that are game-changing and unique and you know revolutionary. It's, it's very rare that those things actually are. I think in this case, we probably can say that about this. I think that the, the opportunity for this to make a fundamental difference to people is huge, right? And that's, that's quite rare, and that's kind of an, an AV-based product. I think it should be correct. It's very exciting to see what happens for the future. Um, gentlemen, Absolutely. many thanks for your time. That's right. Thank you, Paul. My pleasure.